I mean, what I meant by when I said he did not like answering questions or being held to account from people like me. And so some people took it to mean a racial thing. I meant oh, someone who has a different worldview. But since people mm -hmm. raised it and you said what you said, do you think that he was uncomfortable? I didn't want to go there. Do you think he was uncomfortable mm -hmm. sitting in front of a gay black guy? Probably more gay than black, I would think. I hate to say that, but um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't I mean, know. I mean, having to like, answer questions from. Some... I don't think he likes control beyond himself, and okay. so it doesn't matter who's exerting it. I don't think he much likes Joe Biden either. So this is Don Lemon talking about the interview he had with Elon Musk and how Elon Musk, how he perceived that Elon Musk feels about him because Donnie didn't get his way. So let me get this right. The one of the richest men on earth, the third richest man that is literally sending rockets to Mars to colonize Mars, who's building tunnels in LA, who is building electric cars. He's intimidated by Don Lemon because Don is black and gay. Let's just let that settle in. Um, and for Don and whoever this lady is to try to paint this picture that the man was somehow intimidated, this is sick. It, it, it's like really sad, bro. Like that man does not care about you because you black and gay, bro. You were gaslighting him and trying to back him into a corner by asking him very, very weird questions on top of the fact that this was a man that had a contract for you to work on the X platform who would have been paying you. So you were talking literally to your boss. You never did it to anybody that owned CNN. Why would you attempt to do it to him? And he quickly canceled your contract because you, Donnie, you messed it up. You dropped the ball. It has nothing to do with your skin color or your sexuality. And this is what is often is happening because you're in, you're in a protected group, you know, minority plus gay. You know what I mean? And that's a, that's a protected group. Now, if you were minority, gay, handicapped, even more protection. Now, even more protection would be if you were minority, gay, handicapped, and a little person. That would have really given you even more protection, right? Or you could have been black, gay, handicap, a little person, as well as maybe a trans person. All the protections in the world. But I think it's laughable for you to really get on this camera with this lady and to say that this man was somehow uncomfortable sitting with you. As he's trying to explain himself as a man that coughed up $40 billion to overpay for a platform that he doesn't need to stand up for freedom of speech. And yes, people are going to say some things that hurt your feelings. This, this is life, right? But we need to all be able to speak freely and move on. That's all. That's all. People say mean things about Elon on the platform all the time. He's not blocking them or getting rid of them. So it's just a freedom of speech. It's a town hall. And for whatever reason, and, and yeah, things are up, but we need to have freedom of speech. That's all this is about. So tell a good brother, Don, to, uh, to call me.